A $10,000 reward on the table tonight for anyone who can identify a killer. And tonight, there's video of two men police are trying to find. See Pickett live in Arlington for us right now. Yeah, this case uh, has a lot of unanswered questions. That video police uh, think can help them possibly in this situation. The woman who was killed, she was doing an online transaction. She was trying to sell jewelry. Uh, she was meeting that individual at a neutral site. She took someone with her. It's not too far from where we are right now here at her apartment complex. Despite those safety steps, someone killed her. Yes, yeah, it's, it's pretty sad between the holidays, you know. Sean Dunn lives just steps from his murdered neighbor. He now knows the noise he heard was a gunshot. We have construction over here going on in the apartment, so just thought it was a regular nail gun. Some neighbors outside came outside, and I can tell 10 minutes earlier, later, the cops knocked on my door asking me to identify the woman. Dunn lived next to April Van Cleve for six months. The 33-year-old mother lost her life after someone robbed her outside her apartment unit. Arlington police released this surveillance video. It shows two men leaving a Target store on South Cooper, the store April Van Cleve left prior to this recording. She was there with her husband to meet at least one person who agreed to buy jewelry from her. She was trying to raise money at the time uh, for, for Christmas, and when she returned back to her apartment complex, that's when she was actually robbed and she was murdered at the location. Van Cleve was attacked after her husband dropped her off. Detectives defined the men in the video as persons of interest. They were last seen driving that red truck, leaving the Target parking lot. The people that's involved in the video are just a person of persons of interest, and we really want to just talk with them and just to get some more information from them so we can hopefully uh, resolve this. That information, of course, possibly leading to anyone that may be connected to uh, this murder. But again, police only defining those individuals as persons of interest. And again, Oak Farms Dairy, as we mentioned before, a $10,000 reward. That money would go to anyone who can actually define the person or, and or persons uh, who are responsible for this killing. Reporting live, Steve.